two token security matters. The Inspector General of Police, Kayode Egbert Tokun, has condemned the rise in cases of jungle justice across the country. He has ordered the Deputy Inspector General of Police in charge of the Force Criminal Investigation Department to investigate these incidents and bring all culprits to face the full extent of the law. Now, the crime, the unlawful arrest, through a statement by four spokesperson, Muiwa Adejobi, he highlighted a specific case in Edo State. There, a mob had attacked a police station and burned several suspects to death on October the 13th. Now, the Inspector General, while offering condolences to the victims' families, directed the DIG of the FCID to identify and apprehend the criminals responsible for this deplorable act. Now, during a visit to Kaduna, uh, Governor Obasani, the Minister of Defense Mohammed Badaru, has reaffirmed the federal government's advanced plans to launch Operation Fansan Yamba, a joint military command established to address insecurity in the northwest region. The minister emphasized that the command and control center is a critical step towards finding lasting solutions to the ongoing issues of banditry and kidnapping in the zone. He added that the Nigerian government is collaborating with neighboring countries such as Niger Republic as well as security agencies to combat terrorism, ammunition and arms trafficking across the African region. Kaduna Abuja Highway will be much more easier for us and more successful and uh, we will continue to work together closely as you have promised and you have demonstrated to read Kaduna State and indeed the country of this security situation that we are experiencing today. We have seen tremendous successes in the last few months and we will continue to maintain the tempo with your support. We will continue to push and our troops are ready and willing to fight this to an end. In his remarks, the Kaduna State Governor Uba Sani commended the federal government's multi-dimensional initiative to bolster support for security forces and enhance localized intelligence systems. Insecurity has had debilitating effects on all parts of life in the Northwest. Our zone that was the food basket of Nigeria now faces the challenge of food insecurity, our people cannot access health facilities. Some of our children are out of school due to activities of criminals with scant regard for human life and dignity. Poverty has worsened. Fear pervades our zone. We therefore welcome the establishment of this joint military theater and the launch of Operation Pansanyama to tackle our broad range of lingering challenges. The President has charged us to be innovative and to look so deep and find lasting solution to this uh, security problem in the Northwest and also in the country. So we are working very hard and that is the tour, that is the reason for the tour, to listen to you, to listen to people, look at options and, um, and uh, get recommendations and see how best we can tackle this. We are going to be, we are really being innovative. We are working very hard to, to really end this thing and uh, by the special grace of Allah, it will, it will end. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.